Good morning. We are here early in the morning and we're going to try a different soup that I found. I found this in the freezer section in the regular grocery store. Um, it's Phillips Soup for One Maryland Style Crab Soup. And this is not the um, cream of crab. This is the tomato based soup. Which I like mixing the two, you know, cream of crab and the bay crab, Maryland crab. It's got a couple different names, but it's basically the same. It's a tomato based soup. Um, and for the most part, this stuff is made with claw meat. Um, the cream of crab is made with more of like a jumbo lump type crab meat, but the Maryland crab tomato based soup is usually made with claw meat, so it's a little sweeter. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and get into this one. Um, I, I have kind of high expectations. I mean, it's Phillips. However, they don't use Maryland crab meat anymore. So that is an issue, and it has been an issue around here in Maryland for a while. But we're gonna go ahead and give it a shot see if it's any good um it doesn't quite fill the bowl like the other soups i had uh i think it's only 10 ounces of soup um so that you know it was okay i think uh i think it was eight dollars from the store um so it's it's i guess it's kind of priced somewhat similar but um so i mean i've got Carrots and there's some corn in here potatoes It does have uh, a Beef broth in it um, Yeah, I did not read the ingredients. Maybe I will get into those, but I don't know um, So I mean it's a it's a decent soup. I just, it's hard for me to get these soup bowls up here Um I mean, it's got chunks of tomato. It's not a super thick soup, but chunks of tomato. Um, it's got some good stuff in it. Maybe I'll try and read the ingredients. Um, but I wanted to try this anyway. Um, it is very hot. It, uh, it does come microwavable, so you can put this in the microwave, but we all know how I... You know, Chef Mike is not my favorite guy, but he works in a pinch. Um, but, okay, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. Um, I have iced tea over here in case it's too freaking hot. Um, I have extra Old Bay. All right, so this is the Maryland, Maryland style crab soup from Phillips. Uh, cheers. Um, right away, it's not my favorite. Um, it just tastes frozen. Um, I mean, it is frozen, you know, so I guess it's kind of expected on that part, but, um, it's not bad, um. I do think it probably needs some more Old Bay. Um, the crab meat is very small. Um, you know, if you know like claw meat, it is very stringy. I guess that's, I think the best thing to use to describe it for 20. Um, but it, it's not a bad soup. Um, would I recommend this? No, I don't think so. Um, if you want to try it, I mean, it's, it's acceptable, I guess, but I wouldn't go out of my way to get it. Um, it's not terrible at all. I'm not, I'm not trying to portray that at all. Um, but it's, it's just, uh, I don't know about Maryland style. Um, maybe.
it's got a um I, I don't want to say fishy taste that crabs can get sometimes but it's I, I would not say this is the best soup for to represent Maryland style crab soup. I've had much better. Um, in a pinch, maybe this would work. Um, yeah, and I can't even read the ingredients on this stuff because the light out here is even worse than in there. But I'm, it looks like they have a line of uh, different soups out. Um, maybe some of those soups are better. Um, but this is the only one I found. It looks like they have a clam chowder. Yeah, they have a cream of crab. They have a Maryland style crab soup. They have a clam chowder. And I cannot tell what the bottom one is. Put it up there, maybe. Maybe you can read it. Um, ingredients, nutrition, facts. Let's see if I can get the glare away. So it looks like it's got 150 calories in this. And obviously a serving size is one whole container. But yeah, let's uh, throw some more Old Bay in it. Because Old Bay, you know. It does have Old Bay in it already. I can taste it. But, you know, more Old Bay is always better. <laughs> you got to ask anybody in Maryland. That's what they'll tell you. More Old Bay is better. But it is, it is, uh, it is a decent substitute, I guess. Yeah, the Obey helps it a lot. Um, I wouldn't expect to find crab shells in this, but you could. So that's always a concern when you get into like crab soups and stuff like that. But it is decent. It's got some vegetables. I see a lima bean right there, which lima beans are not my favorite either. But, I mean, they're not bad. Um, you would uh, more likely find, um, like, the regular mixed veg in this soup. But it is okay it's if you want to try it and you see it great uh don't go rushing out of your way to get it though um all right i'm gonna get out of here i hope everybody has a great day um and i will see you later in the next video